Mishawaka, Indiana. Dina? What a treat. Anna, what a spectacular race you ran today. You were patient in the first mile. It was a blistering first mile, if I must say so myself. You guys were in hot pursuit of this championship today. But tell me how your confidence level was doing within that first mile when the pace was set out so hard. Um, the pace was all right. I actually got tripped up and fell. I had a cut on my knee, but I mean, it's whatever. I got right back up and I knew the race isn't over. It was just the first, like, 400 meters, so... I just got up, made sure to keep a level head, and I knew the pace would slow up in a little bit, so I just stayed patient. And you maintained confidence throughout. How did it feel to be surrounded by the golden colors of your of your regional team? It was fantastic. It was really comforting, actually, just because I've gotten to know the girls so well, and they're all so nice, and it was just great to be racing with people who I'm like really good friends with now. It was, it was great. There's no doubt that your performances earlier this year, this cross-country season, um, made you a threat out there to, to everyone on the starting line. They knew your name, and you had to come out with a with barbed wire tattoo on your arm just to just to be a little more intimidating. Was that the strategy here? Um, I don't know. It's just something fun that my team did a couple times, and it's just fun. It makes me feel a little tougher, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Well, your legs did the talking today, Anna. It was a spectacular race. We're very proud of you, and I think your, your team might have done. We'll wait for the results to come through, but your, it looks like your team um, had a good day out there as well. So congratulations on leading them. Thank you.